had to be at least 23. I was going to say, I was a betting man, I thought they were at least 23. Would not surprise me if they were 24. I said if I was a betting man, I'd bet a lot of money they're at least 23, but would not blink an eye at them being 24. It's a big okay. arm, and both parts are big, bicep and tricep. Normally a lot of people have one really freaky, and then one's just kind of good. He's got really, really freaky biceps and triceps. Come on, dude. One more. <clears throat> one thing that I wanted to mention was, if you notice every single one of us, we train with perfect form. We're controlling the weight all the way through the movement. So if you notice, obviously, all three of us have pretty decent looking arms. I feel like a lot of that has to do with the way that we're going about it, obviously. Of course, we're gonna, you know, we can throw a little bit of genetics in there, but at the same time, the form is definitely key. Nice little routine on workout today. Uh, it was awesome. We're right at nine weeks out from the Tampa Pro, and uh, things are feeling great. We're emphasizing some new things. Um, we got Eugene doing some stuff with me, and uh, this prep is, um, I mean, honestly, this prep is probably going to be unlike any other prep, uh, and it's 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 going great right now. Of course, we had a little bit of a setback with, you know, some of the um, virus and shutdown and everything that went on. So. Uh, prior to that, things were really rolling, making good gains and progress every single week. Uh, and then, you know, I was still fortunate enough to be able to get some workouts in, but things were just a little bit inconsistent with, you know, missing cardio and um, unfortunately, you know, going to the store and trying to find correct foods and meat and this and that. So, um, so now everything's back to normal and uh, it's made a big difference already. Uh, you know, my weight was kind of fluctuating there when things were we're off uh, and now my weight is uh, what I normally do is, you know, grow into shows. So uh, I think when everything got back to normal, I was like right around 262, 63 and um, morning passed away right now is about 271, 272. So, uh, you know, my coach dominated Cardone and we worked well together and that's really the approach we been doing um, every prep now for the last couple of years this we've been growing into a show and it's been making a big difference so we're kind of we're doing the same thing right now and it feels good so um, and this uh you know this prep is 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 a good one I mean the way I, I see it is um, you know I've been fortunate enough right now to 100% put everything into this prep Don't move, don't move.
I said if I was a betting man, I'd bet a lot of money they're at least 23, but would not blink an eye at them being 24. It's a big okay. arm, and both parts are big, bicep and tricep. Normally a lot of people have one really freaky, and then one's just kind of good. He's got really, really freaky biceps and triceps. Come on, Jeff. One more. But with everything going on right now, uh, you know, I've, I've kind of built the foundation to where I can 100% uh, emphasize this prep. And, and it makes a big difference. I mean, you know, compared to, you know, not having to work uh, eight to 10 hour work days or anything like that. And just being able to honestly eat, uh, sleep, train and grow. And, uh, you know, it's, it's very exciting because you see how the little things make a big difference. Um, and when I say little things, I mean like, you know, getting up in the morning, doing faster cardio, going back home, eating breakfast, eating second meal, third meal, and then taking a nap and then waking up. And, you know, when you are on that type of schedule, uh, you get to see the change in your body. Honestly, I would say on a daily basis, because you're getting the nutrients in, you're getting your training in, and you're getting the sleep in. So, um, you know, I, I see now why, you know, when you do get to that point to where um, you, you've made it to where you're, ex, you know, extremely successful in this industry, and that's all your life revolves around is, uh, you know, prep, training, eat, sleep, and grow, then, yeah, you know, of course, you are going to be the better athlete compared to, you know, someone um, that's, you know, having to work eight to ten hour shifts and then, you know, juggle workouts and then, you know, being late a couple hours on meals and stuff like that. So it's not saying it can't be done. Of course it is. I mean, um, but it's just one of those things to where uh, when you're able to 100 uh, percent emphasize on something specific, then, of course, you know, it's a night and day difference whenever you don't have to juggle, you know, so many different things at one time. So, so right now this is a uh, exciting time because, like I said, we are now we south from Tampa, and then we are full stream ahead going to the Tampa Pro, and and nothing's in the way. So you guys will be seeing change uh, within myself with the things that myself, Eugene, Dominic, and uh, you know Jonathan of what we're going to be doing and you'll, you'll definitely see the change on a weekly basis, so it's gonna be very exciting. How many is that, eight? Yep. I thought you were gonna grab it my bag.